You're more annoyed, it seems, the, about, about Tony Adams still being in Strictly <sighs> and Ellie getting kicked out. I mean, you, honestly, you were raging earlier on there. Well, yeah, exactly. I mean, mm. honestly, mm. It's, it's the Arsenal fans are voting to keep him in, but, I mean, it's embarrassing because... Or I had one week where he danced OK, but on Saturday... <laughs> does it really if, matter, Andy? Well, it does, really. If you watch does the programme and you want the best the dancers to win, you think, he, he was pathetic. Do you think the show is being undermined by the block... by Tony McToneface? It's basically well, what I it do, is, really, isn't it? I do, really, yeah. He was, he was poor. But yeah. what can you do? Okay. It's a popularity contest. <laughs> well, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Ultimately, and, and none of it matters. I do like... A, one of the things I love in the tabloid mm. newspapers mm. is a headline explained. That's where they, they'll do a very clever headline and they'll yeah. think that somehow their the readers don't understand it, you know, which is ridiculous. This is the worst example mm. of that I've ever... The headline was, he thought it was all over. And this is a story about... Wartime RAF logbook reveals how football commentating icon Kenneth Wilson cheated death after the plane he piloted came under heavy fire. He's known for the line, they think, yes, we know that! <laughs> Who doesn't know that? <laughs> Explain it. Oh, you idiots. A man who sits there and punches national newspapers, actually that. physically, with I his fist. I hate it because it betrays an attitude. You know, it betrays that we don't think the listeners are intelligent enough. Well, the readers in this the readers, case. Yeah.